Remove fog lights and replace bulbs. The replacement of the fog lights or the bulb on the Golf 6 is possible without first removing the bumper. Pull out the grill around the fog lights on the sides. Then only remove one screw, Torx 25, and pull the fog light out of the guides. Press the latch on the back and unplug. The bulb can be detached from the reflector by turning it counterclockwise. Removing the bumper. Lower screws. Simply remove all screws, Torx 25, that are connected to the front spoiler lip on the underside. Screws to the side. The bumper is connected to the wheel housing liner four times on each side. And one time at the rear end with the fender. Remove all the screws. As soon as the screws are out, pull the bumper sideways out of the guide. It is best to wiggle a little, up and down, while pulling out at the same time. Upper screws To get to the upper screws, you first have to remove the front grille. Remove the four screws, Torx 25, on top of the grille. Then pull the grill forward out of the bumper. Again, wiggle a bit to loosen the hooks. After the grill is off, you can see the two screws on the bumper, Torx 25. Remove them. Now remove the bumper a bit and unplug the installed electronics. It is best to get help from a second person. Unplug the fog light as already described at the beginning of the tutorial. If that doesn't work, you can turn the bulb straight out of the socket. Headlight washer, optional. If the headlight cleaning system is installed, disconnect the hoses on the right-hand side. Here, loosen one of the hose couplings by pressing the lock and disconnecting the hoses. The washing water that runs out can be collected and reused. Parking sensors, optional. The wiring harness of the parking distance control has a central plug installed on the left side. Simply follow the cable, the plug is located on the left side member. To unplug, use a narrow screwdriver to lever the lock backwards a bit. This releases the lock at the front and you can unplug the connector. After everything has been disconnected, you can remove the bumper completely. Replace the parking sensors. 
push the two holders of the sensor a little to the side. Don't bend. Press on the sensor from the outside with your finger and remove it from the holder. To disconnect, pull the white lock back a bit and press it. Be careful not to lose the rubber seal. 